Hello, everybody. This is Northern Beard. Oh, okay. We're keeping it on the down low. All right. And I'm I'm the mightiest beard. And uh, we two gentlemen are bringing you a educated and philosophical episode of Beardlefield. Yeah! Okay, Axel Rose. Yeah, that's right. Beardlefield is a twice a week series where Northern Beard and myself sit down and have ourselves a nice beer, do a review, and then play some Battlefield 3 tactically. And on this episode, we're actually uh, joined in server, not 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 on not on comms, by yep. the the good old Mr. Assault. Yeah, Mr. Assault's a pretty cool guy. He has a uh, YouTube channel which we will link right now on your screen. You should click it. Say what up. And uh, let them know that the Beards sent, uh, sent you over there to check them out. Damn straight. Yeah. We're going to go ahead and dump you over the in-game comms now. Uh, go ahead and enjoy the episode. Enjoy it, folks. Enjoy it well. Good evening, William. Ahoy there, Steven. How you doing this fine evening? Uh, I got a bit of a head cold. Yeah. I'm not going to lie. It's not great. Well, cheer up, because it's Wednesday, and that means Beardlefield! Oh, dude. Oh, <laughs> uh, the fucking helicopter literally just landed in front of me. I just shot the fucking pilot and the co-pilot out. Did you really? Yeah. Did you get it? it? Just, and then it then, uh, it then blew up, but... Uh, wow. You shot them both out? I think I got a, an assist on one of them. Oh, we'll just take their tank. Okay. Oh, okay. I just got, like, quick-shotted McGee with an N98B by Bastos. I did kill Mr. Assault, though, a fellow YouTube star like us. <laughs> Fuck your shit, Wally. Well, that guy's having a good night. Uh, so yeah, you ready to drink some beers? Yeah, I definitely am. Definitely, I'm always ready to drink some beers. Even though I'm sick and I might not taste it, I'm all, I'm, I'm ready to feel it. Nice. Oh, I just got lit up. That could be taken a few Ten and ways. two, though. I'll, I'll take it. That's a good start. Yeah. Uh, so tonight, we're going to be trying a little something wild from the Lagunitas Brewing Company out of uh, California. Old Cali. Which, uh, which I recently visited. You did? Yeah. And Saw the best, be... one of the best musicians to ever grace this fine earth. Yep. Yeah. Mike, Michael Boltron. Correct. Michael Bolton. I'm, I'm, oh, you, you I, saw the robot I, version, Michael Boltron. <laughs> no. It's, it's not awful. I, I am struggling so hard to not sing some of his songs right now because we're talking about them. Dude, steel bars. Yeah. <laughs> Just hit it. No. Uh, so this is a Belgian IPA. <laughs> comes in, comes in at uh, eight point eight percent. That's a pretty, that's a pretty strong one. Pretty, uh, pretty much not fucking around at all. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty serious. Um, and it's got 72.51 IBUs. Um, <laughs> be pretty right. fucking exact on that. Uh, so yeah, kind of odd. Wow, here's here's some med, bud. Jesus, you got There's something mortaring us. Oh, like, are we getting... no, the viper. I just got taken out giving you meds. Oh, thanks, bud. Oh, I'm down. So, like I said, uh, 72 YBUs and 8.8%, uh, and it's a uh, Belgian IPA. Belgian IPA, which is pretty, I'm pretty excited to try that. I like IPA. Awesome. Well, I'm going ahead to open it up since I'm yeah. uh, in, in the dead zone. I'm going to go a little aggressive on this pour, which may or may not wind up being not a good idea. Not. Seems to be the case here. Not a good idea? Yeah, I got a pretty huge head on this one. Ah, oh, uh, fuck. Shotgun. I'll crack it open. It's pretty, uh... Down. It's, uh... It's pretty... Almost like, uh... Almost lagery looking. It's, like, really clear, really yellow. Uh... Pretty carbonated. Uh, what do you got for a head on yours? Oh, okay. Spawn on you immediately got shot. Lot of head, though. Yeah. Ton of head. This looks... Cr wow. This is like a lager. Uh, just super, super see-through. I mean, a lot yep. of head, dude. That was a really tame pour, based on what you said uh, uh -huh. with your pour. And I got, I got an easy finger, but very, very frothy. Has strong characteristics. I'm finally gonna change my perk because I suck. Um, 
strong characteristics of um, of a signature IPA where it has a lot of lacing and whatnot. Um, yeah, I can see it as, as the head slowly dissipates. I can see that the lacing is is sticking around yeah. pretty good there. Yeah, trying it, to pour a little bit more here. It looks marvelous. It does look pretty nice. Uh, it are you smells available to scent? Amazing, to be honest. I mean, it's uh, this is Ooh, Mr. Assault down again. Damn, man. A little rival Fucking action. triple kill. Well, rip. Yeah, dude, legit what you, trip. What do you got on the uh, the scent there? The smell. The smell of blood. My enemies eat <laughs> dirt. Um, I'm gonna go in for. Ooh, ooh, that's that's that wild. Um, that smells that smells amazing. I can't quite get a. A, a ping on what it is right now. I'm in a little getting shot. I'm dead. Uh, let me go in. I got him. I got him. Uh, let's see what we got here. Huh. Oh god. I'm down. Assault got I mean, me. It smells. It smells uh, just great. I mean, it's got a nice fruity. Um, yeah, it's definitely fruity. Like, like maybe apples or pears. Yep. It it smells dry. If that makes sense. Orchardy. So it does smell dry. I'm gonna go with uh, with apples is probably being accurate. Now, oh yep. shit, the uh, Amtrak is right up on us. I can't do jack diddly about oh, it. Oh, I got. Uh, okay, I'm gonna just, try to just, just get knock. around on. Oh, I'm I'm in a position. Get it. He's nuking me. I'm dead. Revenge me. I got him. Nice. I see it. Um, oh, I got rezzed. Yeah. Anything? Uh, anything else on nose here? No, that's that's about where I'm at. Smelling kind of like yeasty from the Belgian, uh, the, the the Belgian quality. I from actually, the yeast. yeah, and I wanted to talk about this. So there's a special yeast that's you. Oh shit! Aw, I was reloading. And Mr. <laughs> Assault got me. It's all right. I got three and one on on Mr. Assault. I feel so proud of that. Um, this uses it's fermented with what they call a West Molly yeast strain. I probably butchered yeah. the pronunciation of that. Um, Likely. Yep, as is typically the case. Yeah. So, oh shit! I'm fucking <clears throat> engineer. I didn't mean to be engineer. Fuck. Fucking up, dude. Yeah. All right. So yeah. Um, you know, like you said, smells. It smells dry. You know, apples. Strong fruit presence. Um, yeah. Big. Oh, just pulled a Steve. Did you? Oh. <laughs> it rolled up my nose. Nice. Which is good. That'll, because that'll I'm help sick. you for tonight, right? Yeah. Oh man, it burns. Yeah. Uh, let me see. You get any like spice on it? Pepper or anything? Uh, I'm not getting a ton of that. Just it's mostly the fruits. Oh, oh wow. shit! Just, just shot Pepe Apollo. Pepe 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 Abel. Pepe Abel. There it is. All right. <laughs> You want to, uh, All right, if we're, yeah, if we're ready for it, it, I'm going to go ahead and dive in, take a swig. Yeah, tear it up. That's really nice. Um, it's pretty dry, um, just like the smell would indicate. Um, so you get some, like, definitely some bitterness up front from the hops. Um, it's not as Belgian-y as, uh, as it could be. As it could be, um, I've had some beards that are pretty frickin' Belgian-y, um, like funky and just just really thick and big. And it's actually pretty. Um, I don't want to say light. Light's not the right right word. It's a pretty big beer, but definitely getting definitely getting some of the Belgian-iness, just not a shitload. Um, what do you got? You gotta take a sip yet? No, I'm. Uh, I just outran a tank and then I sniped a sniper. Awesome. And I just knife the kid. Non animation. Take a sip here. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and take a quick sip. Sweet this. Sure. Oh shit. Mm. On the swig there, I definitely picked up on my nose, like a peppered apple. Yeah, that's weird. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, a little bit of the pepper, the clove kind of <clears throat> uh, spiciness kind of comes yeah. through. This is a taste. this is this is a very very unique brew. Um, wow, that kid is upset. Um, it's uh, it's creamy like a pale ale, a lot of malt, yeah. 
but it has a, a incredibly strong hop punch. Like, I, a very strong hop punch. Yeah, it's definitely it's definitely a hop forward. Yeah. Like, the malt is there and balances it, but it's definitely a hop kind of blast right up front. Definitely an IPA. Uh, no. Yeah, no shit. Um, but, I mean, it's, it's, it's really well balanced. I mean, I can't see where that kid is. I don't know if you could. He's behind you. Okay. You're about a second too late on that heads up. Sorry, bud. <clears throat> I just saw it go down, and I was like, mm, I don't see who the fuck the kid is. Yeah, you know, it's all right. It took me a second to figure out where he was shooting me from. Um, anyway. Yeah, balanced. I mean, it's, it's really well balanced. Hop and just the, the malt. It's pleasant. Um, yeah. It's good. Real good. Oh, I got a just that was just a just a sprayed spray rip. What do you uh what do you think of for a mouthfeel on this? Um medium. He's coming around to, to you unless you want to come back over here and see for him. Coming. Um Oh he's he kept going. Um on the heavier side of medium, on the bigger side of medium. Yep. Um it's pretty easy to drink. It's uh, I've got a little bit of a hop drag there on the tail end. Yeah, it's a, it's a uh, little boozy on the very tail end. Oh, he's stuck. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah. Oh, come the fuck Just on. Recorded that. Up to Daisy. Right behind you. Um. Let's see what else we got on this mouth feel here. Ooh, it's pretty smooth and creamy, just like you said. Pretty carbonated. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's it's pretty carbonated, um, but I'm not. On that's a. not really. Uh, that's not really bothering me. I'm coming. I'm not really having an issue with the carbonation on this. Um, <clears throat> definitely getting a little tickle in the back of the throat. Right, right. Um, but it's you know, it is what it is. Some 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 beers are carbonated, some aren't. Oh, that was a shitty name throw. Um. What do you? What about you? Anything? Anything else to say? I'm gonna mirror the, uh, that. I mean, it's it's uh, medium. It's sticky. It's drinkable, and uh, you know, very. It's very pleasant. Um, you know, the creamy from the malt helps out with the carbonation and the. Um, got that kid. Um, it helps balance all of that out. I mean, it's very pleasant. I'm I'm really liking it. I mean, this is a. This is a. I mean, I guess the belt. Oh shit. Uh, hang up, buddy. I got you in two seconds. Oh, shit. Just fucking getting completely lit up. Cement shoes. Oh, shit! I fucking threw a grenade. I thought, they, I thought that wasn't, uh... I thought it was behind the barrier there. Uh, yeah! So what's your overall on this one, then? Um, I'm re I'm really enjoying this beer. It's it's you know, it's kind of like the best of both worlds. It's like it's a big beer, and it tastes big, but it's like uh, really it's actually pretty easy drinking. The it's not super boozy. Um, it's just kind of a nice uh, all around all around beer. Like I don't feel like I need it to be a certain time of year to drink this. Right. If I just want to have a nice beer. Unfortunately, it's only available is, for a certain time of year. Yeah, this well, the little some some male is is similar to this, just not quite as uh, not quite as boozy, not quite as big. Um, but yeah, I mean, I'm gonna go ahead and give this one uh, a four point two five. Oh, nice! It's a nice strong representation. Yep. Oh my god! I can't believe I killed that kid. Uh, yeah. So I'm gonna give it a. Uh, um, pretty pretty close actually. I'm gonna give it a four point five. I mean, I'm I'm loving it. Nice, good. What's what's your uh, what's your fa favorite part about it? Well, I love the IPA. I love that it's a it's it's like a creamy IPA. You know, yeah. kind of like a milk stout is a variation of a stout. This yeah. uh, Belgian IPA is kind of like a little creamy IPA. I like it. I mean, it's 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 very nice. I I love how how potent the hop is. I mean, it's like a hop uppercut. It really is. It's a it's a pretty aggressive hop attack. Shit, I am in a bad position here. 
I don't know how that kid survived. I got an AN-94 round in his forehead. Yeah, there it goes. All right, let's wrap this up. Yeah, so this is going to get a, um, a decisively strong uh, wizard beard from the Mighty Beards yep. Gaming. That's the uh, True. a little something wild from Lagunitas Brewing Company out of California. 8.8% uh, uh, Belgian IPA for uh, four beards from the Mighty Beards Gaming. Booyah! Yeah. Mm. Ah, that creamy IPA. You wanna, uh, you wanna take us out? Yeah! Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the Mighty Beards of Gaming right here on YouTube, and then head on down to the description below to follow us on Facebook and Twitter. And then, uh, stick around, uh, in the next few days to get updates and get another episode of Beardfield. Yeah! Well, that being fucking, fucking, fuck, yeah, I got him. Alright, that being said, uh, I am Northern Beard. Oh, I'm the Mightiest Beard. Yeah, uh, the rainbow, where? And we are getting fucking shot from all angles. We'll see you next time on another episode of Beardfield. Thank you.